This episode of Shots of Oz brought to you by Toyota. So I'm really into the topic of serendipity, moments of unexpected relevance, moments in which you find yourself looking for something, you find something else, and what you realize is that what you found is more conducive to your needs than what you thought you were looking for. And Eric Davis says that serendipity lives in the space of juxtaposition, in the space of diversity. He says that juxtaposition is the basic formal operating space of serendipity, the space in which you're more likely to make unexpected connections between subjects, the spaces in which ideas, a rich diversity, a rich ecology of stimulant ideas can intermingle and create these spaces of innovation in your head from just you know, finding these unusual combinations among subject matter. And he talks about places like the city, you know, which is density and its diversity of viewpoints, perspectives, and memes, you know, this supermarket of memes that creates these unexpected collisions and creates that creativity. But he also talks about places like Burning Man, you know, which is this festival where juxtaposition is, you know, reigns supreme, you know, where a piano against some like stark desert contrast is next to like some overgrown dice, you know, alluding to like some Alice in Wonderland-esque ra rabbit hole, you know, next to some like crazy naked girl. And that unique juxtaposition floods you with dopamine, floods you with novelty, and just awakens this lightning bolt of meaning in the perceiver's mind, you know, these heightened pattern recognition that rush that we associate with creativity. So again, it's all about juxtaposition. The juxtaposition of extremes creates that basic formal operating space of serendipity.